back in we go to figure out if this is going to function. For it being almost winter up here, it is hot. Go here. Okay, hopefully this works good now. No, oh, it's not looking it's not looking good. Is my graphics still stupid? No. So they actually did update, so hopefully that fixes it. Oh, it actually just resumed where I was. That's nice. I'm still not feeling the best about it. There's still little spurts of lag here and there. In terms of strength of my... The hive, um, I feel like I'm like second and second by like a hair. The only other guy that's at least does more damage than me is, uh, Chit because he kind of actually knows what he's doing. I think this is his alt or this is his main something. I don't. He just knows what he's doing. He actually has all of his blueprints that he wants for his build. And as for me, I'm just kind of winging it. But me and him did a uh, one of the I don't know what it's called the little armored truck that drives around. Uh, me and him actually did that and just PvP there for fun. And I w <laughs> he pretty okay. So to put it bluntly, he. Pretty much, he got me probably twice as much as I got him, but it was only because I was trying to use this slow firing pile of crap, and I don't definitely don't need to use that because I was using the slow pile of crap. It um, that was rude. That's very rude. Go away and drink some water. Um, <laughs> I told him I wanted a rematch at some point when I actually got my SMG because I'm using shrapnel didn't realize I don't want this Get out of my hand go away okay so it's not letting me, it wasn't letting me drop it there's nothing around here I don't know where everything is in a lot of these areas so I feel like I'll be bothering people. Like I'll, I'll just be making people cringe by how slow I am at finding some of these chests. Like you should know where that is already. Well, I don't. I don't think I ever will. Who sees me? Like somebody back here or around me has to. Oh, he's right below me. There's a fetch a lot bunny up here. How does that work? I picked up a fetch a lot, but it... Okay, no. The climbing down ladders is cursed right now. That looks like where probably everything is. Just do the perimeter, I guess. No, I like lore in games, but I can't fully figure this one out. Like, I don't know what Starfall is. There's like small little pits, pits, little bits that I don't understand, and I want to know. Oh, I actually see that coming. The amount of morphic checks. Check. Why am I just not able to talk for a second? Maybe let me drink water. Maybe that's. Probably 
my soft little mushy brain doesn't know what it's doing. More random junk. If I keep picking up all this junk from the, these places, y'all are going to see my house relatively fast. And, uh, wow, you were running at me with some energy. I don't know if I liked it. Kind of freaked me out. I don't think I've ever actually seen him run that fast. Like, he was almost determined to get me. I don't like that you're just staring at my rift anchor. Like, that's mine. I see you. Okay, that's it. I'm just gonna go over here. Definitely not gonna be anything over there. Wouldn't make sense for it to be. Wait, you're telling me that the big guy isn't even a requirement for this one? Like, he's just kinda here to be here? And I used to live beside this guy. Like, I used to live, like, right on the other side in those trees over there. I don't know why I'm... Like, acting like I'm doing so much damage because these guys are level 23. You had to be right. I feel like I'm doing something wrong. By not, like, do I not know the button to drop them? Is that, is that what the issue is? How do you, how do I get over to you? I feel like I have to go up. And then there's like a way down. And they only put that big guy here to make you think this is where you need to be when you don't. So everything's a puzzle. Okay, so. Might as well, while I'm just talking about the game. Um. I just will just give my opinions on it. I don't really know what to talk about while I'm just running around like this. But like... Okay, graphics wise? I, I'm doing just a full game review now. I like, I like the graphics. For a free game, it's amazing. And... I'm... Hello. I'm very... Like, I'm a... I'm a sucker for details on things like this for games. That's just because I went to school to be a 3D modelist or EA. But I I like the fact that this game is free but has so much detail put into it. Like it's Almost an abnormal amount of detail. It, it makes the standards go up. I think the only one that I've seen with even a close amount of detail was probably... I don't even remember what the game was called. It was an MMO. I feel like they ended up actually... It was free to play and then they made it not free to play. I think that's what it was. I can't remember the name of it. It was like an RPG MMO. And it started as a free to play. And then when people actually started downloading it, I guess the company that was hosting them was like, make it worth something. And they went along with it. And now I think it's like, you gotta pay like 15 bucks to get access to it or something. I mean, I could be 100% wrong of the exact price, but I do know that is pretty much the story for that game. I don't know if anybody actually knows the game that I'm talking about, though. But I spent a lot of time, actually, before playing this. I downloaded it and then didn't play it for maybe a month. Oh, well, there it is. So after this place, I'm going home. I started doing a bunch of research on it and seeing pictures and artwork and everything and just like basic little pieces. I'm not one, I don't like getting spoilers for gameplay. So I tend to just kind of, I, I wanna see pictures and artwork, but I won't watch somebody's let's play. You are right behind me and I don't like it. 
but I ended up finding out that it was, of course, it was a free-to-play game. It was by a company that uh, is very much on the pay-to-win scale when it comes to mobile games. Like, this is unique. And apparently the people that have been hosting, not the dev team, like, not the people that made Once Human, but the ones that are hosting it, have been consistently pressuring the devs to make this game worth something. And they refuse. Like, they, and I mean, you can't blame them. Hello? Why is there no button? There's no button on this thing. There's no nothing on this thing. I can't. Let me up. Am I missing something? I, I feel like I'm dumb. This elevator, I guess, just doesn't want to work. It sucks. How would I even get over there then? And I can't run. That's the other problem. But anyway, they have been consistently pressured and I can see how this game actually could be worth something. Like, I mean, I would put something on it. Did you seriously wait until I walked away to go up? It, it seriously waited until I walked all the way over to the other side of the room to actually go up. Okay, I pushed the button. Take me away. And anyway, they are like admirable about it. It will not be free. It won't be pay to win. All of their in-game purchasables are cosmetics. Like, and I respect that a lot. And when it comes to cosmetics, I actually really do like their cosmetics. Like, there's a lot of detail put into them. Granted, the men are, like, in every single game that exists, men's outfits and cosmetics are trash. But even still, in this game, they're not terrible. Like, you can still make decent things. I, I play a male character, but a female character wouldn't actually be bad. Like, the cosmetics, you can... The thing is, you can even mix match different cosmetics together to make different stuff, and every, almost every single piece of armor and cosmetic piece looks good with something else that's not part of it. And they're aware of that. So, is that a... There's just a weapons crate sitting out here, or is that just a tiny crate that's just lodged in the ground? Tiny crate lodged in the ground. So the fact that I just went through this building and still didn't find the mythic crate tells me that it's going to be lost, lost, lost in this collage of just crap, of an oil rig. Why is that guy spark? Oh no, he's not. He looked like sparks to me. I I thought he was like staticky. Ugh, I I hate being overweight. But I'm too much of a stickler to put things on the ground. Okay, let's just go up here, whether there's anything up here or not, just to see if I could find where stuff is. Gross. I hate spiders so much. People that are from Australia, I don't understand how you can deal with the monstrosities that are down there. I mean, I came... I came from the army and I've seen some stuff there and I'd rather not- I'd rather deal with that than spiders. Or like half of the demon creatures y'all have, like, what do you- I- I thought of, what, like a sandworm, I think is what they're called or something like that. Like why- why are they like 12 feet long? And under the ground and look like if you step on one you're just- you might as well just give it your leg. Every single creature that'll end your life is over there. It's like you, you wake up in the morning and it's just a gamble for your life. Why? Why, light bulb? Where is this chest? I'm starting to not like this place. I tend to like everywhere in this. Even the factory areas look nice to me. Bro, your house is huge. Abnormally huge. Wait, is that- is that my- 
that it why is your house that big like I hope my hive members see this and they're just like why what do you even do with that much I bet if I go over there right now it's gonna be like hollow on the inside I feel like I'm talking crap about my, my hive for no reason. But I can. My hive. I still don't- I'm still missing one of the weapon and armor crates. And the mythic. And I feel like I'm just freaking lost. And I'm slow, so it just makes everything worse. That's the way to, I didn't even pick anything up. How'd it get worse? Oh, because of freaking food. I'm not able to move. That didn't help. Is it going to be like something like half of the jump puzzle areas where it's like on the roof? Wait, no. I know where it is. I, I saw it already. I know where everything is. I just need to figure out how to go down. How do I get down? It's gotta be an area, and it would make sense if it was he- Okay, no, I'm- I'm absolutely blind. There's no possible way I'm actually this blind. There- there is a full-sized elevator that is lit up from the beginning. Just sitting here. This is just sad. I would be that guy. They just start hitting me from behind and I'm just standing here. I will take all of your stuff. What is that weird dark shadow? Is that other gear chest down here though? That's the true question. Yes, it is. Ew. Sludgy. I wonder what I'll be like when I actually get my first viewer on this. I don't even know if I've had a viewer. I can't even see that. I just realized I can't even see if people are watching. I could have been talking to people this entire time and just now I feel awkward. Now I feel like I was actually being watched this whole time. person that may, may or may not be there. Is that going to get rid of- I could have done that from the beginning and moved slightly faster. Why does this feel like a- a mayfly hideout? Like the way it's set up is it's too dirty to be Rosetta. And it's too neat to be... That's mayflies, isn't it? That is mayflies. Okay. I, I was right. Back to my house where all of my animals that phase through walls are. I feel like probably the only one. Oh no. Other people are online. Still overweight. Even after all that, I still didn't actually get any freaking blueprints. Why? Why? Oh, you just gonna go into the corner there? Okay, you do you. Please don't push me out the way next time. And junk I don't need. I'm not gonna worry about any of those right now. Get away! Don't you have like corn to go be planting? Did he run out of corn already? Like, is he just walking around for? No he did. I'm not complaining, but like. Go plant me more corn. I don't even need- 
I really don't need him to do anything right now. Like the amount of corn that I have, I can't even produce enough corn ale. That sucks that all went bad. Deviated corn in there, because can. Fill it up. All the way up. Never mind. All that. Ah yes, carrying so many bottles of alcohol that it's crushing me. Get out of my pocket, please. Thank you. Does corn not get preserved if it's in? Like, how did all of my corn go bad overnight? Three hours, one day. There's no... That doesn't make sense. All of my fish are almost dead. All of these went bad. Oh, I know what it was. I ran out of power in the middle of the night, apparently. And everything went bad because of it. Oh, that sucks. Well, now that that's done. Wait, it's not done. My pockets are still full of crap. Okay, let me go clear it. When they brought the Way of the Winter update, like, they changed so much stuff. Like, I know the week before they released it, like, everybody in my hive would save up all of their cortexes and do them all at the same time. Like, we just go like, okay, who's going first? Okay, the next guy go, and then the next guy go. It was just... just drop everything off, screw it, I don't care. And then, after that update now, it's like, we did 40 in my tower and then they still have all of theirs saved up and they're they're gonna have a ton now that they can't do anything with because they were in my team when we did it so like that's hive member that's a hive member where's the ugly house seriously it is it's vile this is actually one of the newest people that was added to our hive he was here beforehand and it only recently got extremely ugly. It's like when you get close enough to it, it's absolutely hilarious. Oh. Oh, the lag. It's trying to render. I'm just... I, I want to get close enough just so that it turns how it should look. There it goes. The, his entire house looks like sparkly, like a nightclub. This is another thing. They built a defense float for a parade and uh, didn't even get to use it because of we did my tower and they changed how it works. I don't know why I'm going all the way back in here. Like I need to go to Blackfell, run, do a formula run, probably clear my inventory again and then go back at trying to find other areas that I haven't been to. Is my truck still here? No. I see that this person copied me. I did the similar thing with my truck, but I had like plants and couches along the side and everything. Theirs has been here for so long and it had no decor in it. I think they saw mine and were like irritated about it. I would be too. I can decorate pretty good when I actually have stuff.
back at the looting. There's like no point in me actually coming up here. Like I never get anything from this chest or the gear crate that's downstairs except junk. But like, I might as well get them, you know? Like if, if the option for a crate is here, I might as well just take it. Even if I get absolute junk out of it, it's still going to be scrapped down and gear crates usually always give you a mod so you have something to tear apart. wasn't a formula. Also, can somebody explain to me what the point of the um, the metal shelf is and why are people paying so much for it? Like they they're they're practically they, they'll maul each other over a shelf. Like isn't it just a decor item? Like maybe you could put something on it, but like Oh. That was new. I stepped on a lamp and my camera got sent to heaven. Oh, that's the truck. Should I do it? It's kind of boring when there's nobody around. It's anyway. It's not that big of a deal. Did I grab this? I think I did grab this one all the way over here. Yeah. And to go finish off this loop. What's the point of shotguns in this? I've never understood that. Like, sure, the shotguns, they probably could pack a punch at close range, but, like, half the bosses you don't want to be standing on top of. I don't understand. I don't understand. I only, I just read the chat and saw somebody has a Doom Bringer build. It just doesn't make sense to me. Oh, you took more shots than I thought you would. best place this building and the next building I'm going to are like the best ones when it comes to getting formulas like seriously it is insane I'm pretty sure I'm just overweight from ammo at this point because I can clear all the stuff that actually causes my weight and still somehow be like right at the cusp of being fat Investigate the truck. Find a way to stop it. It's not even near me. Oh, it is. It's like right over there. I'm not even doing the event. I don't care. I'm minding my own business. You can go away. Go away, truck. I'm looking for formulas. I have like five of those already. That's the one thing I hate is when you get junk like that. They don't weigh anything in your pocket, but like they just take up space. And you don't want to just start throwing them around. Honestly, if it's like if it's an item that I don't know what to do with and I just like I already got one, probably like for example that um alarm clock or whatever. I already have one and it's actually used already at my house. So it's like I don't need them. I'll just throw it on the ground. And I'm not going to go and ask if somebody needs it. It's not that I don't care. If, if you need it and I have it, and you say something before I do get rid of it, I will just give it. I don't care. I, I will give away thousands of tungsten if you need it. I'd, I tend to help out everybody that I can, but... 
I just find them so useless. They're just so common and everywhere, and I keep getting them that I just start throwing them on the ground. Like, I think yesterday I probably dropped, like, 45 items on the ground. Just because I... And the thing is, I actually took a lot of them and tried to use as much of it as I could. Where did his teddy bear go? Did he just disappear? I don't know. Still just wasting ammo. I don't know why I'm freaking out about ammo, because I made 20,000 of each one, but it's still like I don't want to use all of it. And I feel like the moment I stop thinking about my ammo is when I'm going to start burning through it. Or my gun's going to break. Stop screeching. Annoying. Gimme. Give Gimme. Give All that. This room is like my favorite. Every time I come here I get at least something, and this is probably gonna be my first time I don't get something. This room and the backyard are like the best. And I'm already overweight. Probably should figure something out for ammo. I wish ammo didn't weigh so much, but at the same time it makes sense. Like every game you play that has ammo, you can just stockpile thousands of it. And never actually have it affect your weight. So I like that this game actually has the fact of your ammo weighing something. Because I mean, in the real world, you don't think about it. But, like, one magazine for an AR is, like, half a pound to a pound. They they do have some heft to them, and people don't realize that. And that's just the magazine. With ammo, obviously. Without any form of ammo in it, they probably weigh... I don't, I don't know how to put a weight on that, like a quarter of a pound. They're usually made out of, like, aluminum or plastic. Composite materials. I'm talking about ammo, like like some sort of gun nerd. I'm embarrassed of myself half the time. Clearing some inventory. I don't even need all of this stuff. I really don't. And that's seriously where all the weight's coming from. Is my ammo. I have so much just pointless junk. Wow, that just emptied my entire inventory. I wasn't I in the fourth crate already as well? I was. So why is the third crate only got 39 items in it? Ugh, I just organized all of that and I've already messed up freaking organization. Is he tearing his house down? He is. He's tearing his house down. Why is everybody changing their house up? And he's moving it all over there. Ugh. I, I mean, it's like I can't complain. I plan on redoing mine as well. For anybody that doesn't know, I don't own these windows. Somebody in my hive does. That's the perks, is you could share them. As long as one person owns the packs. I like that. That's just so cool. Uh, you could share it with your hive mates. I think it's like up to four people you could share the items with.
this is pretty much how I've been spending. Like, every time I get on this game, I do a couple runs of, like, looking for formulas, and then I just sprint in circles around my house. I don't know what to do. We've already completed Leia. I, I mean, I guess we could keep running Leia. I mean, I have a level 4 Rebecca. The nerds that are inside of my hive that went and did it yesterday without me ended up getting level 5s. So that was that was irritating. They ended up inviting me all the way when they were at Eve. They did the whole thing and then invited me for Eve because... I guess I have higher survivability than them. They all kept going down. There were three of them doing it. And somehow the weakest one that was in my hive they were able to survive longer than the guy who does more damage than me. I can't get over the fact that it's just a floating diamond. And it's like their favorite house they've built. I like my house, but... I've rebuilt my house about... nine times. And I'm on phase four. And it's not like I just moved it and it didn't fit. It's like I moved to a new location and built something and I was like, okay, it looks good. And then I noticed there's just this, that one small thing that feels like it's missing. So. so I'm like, okay, I'll just tear it down and redo it. Go and do that. And then I end up building the new house, finding out that I like, oh, I like this new thing that I did. And then still feel like it's missing something so that's my my issue with my houses is like i get something that i'm proud of and then proceed to not like it ever so probably again before this season ends and we all go to the winter i'm probably going to make another one actually i kind of already have an idea for another one the issue is i i like lifting the foundations up a little bit so it's kind of like a lifted house in a way and I know right now my foundations for this place are practically like non-existent. They are as low into the ground as they can get. But usually I have them lifted up. But for some reason... Nope. Oh, I'm about to get yanked outside. There we go. I closed my door too fast. Um, for some reason, ever since that update, whenever I use my defense tower it spawns all the enemies like right in this area underneath the foundations and they tear my house down from the inside like originally when I moved to the salt lakes I lived like over there somewhere and I ended up actually moving over here because I lost my base over there I I completed the defense they didn't get to the tower because the tower was like this this tower hasn't changed but the house itself they spawned in the floor and they ripped all the way through the floor to get to my tower before anything could happen like they wouldn't get my turns when picking what did you lock on to you just seriously lock okay everything just locked onto the one goat and they still didn't even get him like did they even hit they got him to half health I apparently can't aim. Ugh. Yesterday I tried streaming and the funniest thing happened is, is like right over there I had an invisible creature spawn and it was hilarious because it was called an ew. I don't know what an ew is. E-W-E. But it was hilarious. And it allowed me to skin the invisible animal. Which, it, it was obviously a sheep. Because it gave me sheep stuff. But.
Sorry, I had to help the wife with her sins. What we got online? How many people we got? Still three. Three, and I know one of them is tearing his house down, and the... Did he seriously just remove an entire layer in, like, one second? Can I see him from here? And then them, I don't know where they went. They just abruptly disappeared. They're, like, never at their house. I think, like, once in a blue moon, you'll actually see them there. It's funny. Because it's like, they, I think they show up just to repair their gear, and then they're gone. I'm spending way too much time just talking. I I just don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I should probably go and do something. Not bore everybody with just pointless banter for no reason. Let's see if there's another area of something that I didn't get the rift anchor for. Ar Ar Arlik? Ar Alkirk? I don't know how I said Arlick out of that, but whatever. I royally messed that one up. It was over by Greywater. I was just over here. Like right here. Yeah. Hmm. I didn't do this whole area, I guess. Is that two trucks going to the same place? I don't know. Okay, let's just, um, wow, there's like, ah, let's go to gray water. Another thing is I have been waiting. It has been like 30 hours now I've been waiting on this game's support to get back to me because I lost a bunch of my, like, actual purchased items. They are... Like gone for no reason and I've tried to get in contact with them and nobody answers the request why am I just going up here like I'm just gonna go shopping I'm gonna go all the way over there am I gonna hit the no maybe if V flapped his wings we could go further Also, I'm excited for The Way of the Winter, and I'm definitely going to be streaming more. Like, there's going to be a lot more going on, because right now, this part of the season, I pretty much are... I mean, I'm already built all the way up, did all the dungeons, completed all the bosses on Pro. Like, there's not really much more content for me other than trying to get 100%, which is my goal. I'm going to try to find all of the attachments and like blueprint pieces that I can just so when I go to the way of the winter I'm pretty much set up to start but when I get to way of the winter I'm definitely going to be streaming it more and there's definitely going to be stuff happening probably going to be building my house 400 times and I also don't I don't know anything about um way of the winter like I the most that I know is hypothermia like, that's literally as far as I can... These enemies are 26. The most I know is literally hypothermia is a problem. So, build warm, I guess. I know some of the gear has... Like, temperature warnings or ratings to them. Stardust canned fruits, oh boy. Is that a subway? I feel like this building is way too big to still not have anything in it. Like, I feel like there's got to be more here. This building is just nothing, I guess. There's nothing in here. Is there an elite enemy? Nope. Fill my pockets so that I'm all chunky and ready to go back to my house in four minutes. I 
I get the whole budgeting thing of like reuse buildings, but there sometimes some of the stuff in these maps is so overly reused that it's kind of just irritating. Like those buildings right there that I just passed are probably in every city that exists. Go up the ladder. Get on the ladder. But you can just phase through, I guess. Something on here? No, why is there even a ladder? Oh, wait. Let's not be hasty. No, I was too- I should have been hasty. Ah, spider. Is that what they do in Australia? Like, if you smush one, do they just explode? Hello? Where did he go? They ring around Rosie with a freaking spider. Okay, now I'm starting to think that Alkirk is just weird. It's just an odd place. It doesn't make much sense. Why does this door go to a wall? Imagine working here and you're like, time for the break, and you gotta wiggle out of the back door. Maybe that's why there's no doors. They try to open the door, they just get smushed. You're telling me that there are two... Not one, but two armor and weapon crates here. And I haven't found either of them. The only thing that I have done from the objective list is literally shoot things. Give me the goodies. Let go. Go the freaking thing. Hey, I found one! Actually, I don't... That is a gear crate. How do I get up there? Well, I don't think I was supposed to be here. Ah, that's how you get up there. It's a jumping puzzle if I've ever seen one. This is not how you get up here. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Can I... Can I like... Oh, well, now I'm down here. It's a gear crate. Why do I keep doing that? Seriously, like, why do I just keep going back and... I think I know how to get up there and it involves this hill. As much as I don't want it to involve this hill, it's going to. I didn't need that crate, I, w I would go somewhere else. Have I been here? No, I haven't. Or I have. That building looks kind of familiar. I have. I think I jumped from over here. How exactly am I going to be able to get to that building? Probably here. Yeah. My luck is I would fall in that tiny little crack. Um, where Rift Anchor's this way? Doesn't look like there's gonna be anything interesting back that way. Usually, when it comes to places like this and gear and weapon crates, it's the building that stands out is the one that has something to do with it. Like, it usually has one of the crates you need or mythic crates on the roof. Like this building, for example. Most likely going to have one of the items I need.
Good storage crate. Anything, something on the roof. So most likely a, I'm going to say it is not the mythic. I'm thinking it's going to most likely be a weapon crate. Nope, I'm going to say gear crate. I would say it's like a good rule of thumb that like if the build if it's up on the roof it's something good. But like this would be the time when I say that and the item that's on the roof is like a medicine cap. Hey, I was right, it was a weapon crate. What is going on over there? Why are there so many jellyfish? But now we just need the mythic crate. I'm trying to see if maybe I can see where it would be. Maybe over there. I don't think it'd be that way. But at the same time, I don't know. Leave me alone. Why are they glowing? Oh, that's why. Rainfall Reaper. That did a lot of damage to me. Why? Probably gonna find this mythic crate somewhere and call the stream there. Most likely. That was, I hated how that person just stood up. I usually with these places try to find the stuff on my own. I know there was one time, and I can't remember exactly what place it was. But the mythic crate took me so long to try to figure out where it was that I actually used the interactive map to find it. Like, I found everything but the mythic crate. Or no, I, I even found the mythic crate. I found everything but a weapon crate. And for some reason, I I had picked up a gear crate and then picked up a weapon crate and it only registered one of them as being in the area. So I had to find another one. It, it, it was like all kinds of ridiculous. Another air conditioner. Oh, I got a formula for it. Nice. Mythic crate. Didn't I just see a little sign somewhere? Or like a little... Thingy. I thought I just saw like a little... Hate him. Thing. Like a, a, loot, a loot box light. I guess I'm going insane. I swear I saw something. Like right when I was standing out here. Let's do that again. No, there just ain't nothing. I'm just crazy. It's gotta be nearby, right? Oh. Starting to not even know what I'm looking for. I just smacked my microphone without thinking about it. Watch they like put the mythic crate this time like just on a hill. Middle of nowhere. Could be up there. Actually, it most likely is up there. If I was trying to decide where it was, it'd most likely be up there. Or down here inside of the supermarket. Because I didn't realize that this was 
area down here that I haven't been yet. Uh, definitely up here. Starwalker. Big enough building. Deviant. Hello? Who are you? Paper doll. Might as well. Start giving them the people. Pretty much all we do anyway. Hey, look, another paper doll. The mountain's dead. Anybody else see him waving at me? Or was that just me? Is there something on the roof? No. Even though I don't know why he was up there then. That was a relatively big dude to just be up there for no reason. I actually feel like there is something up on the roof. And they're gonna make me like stand directly below it to actually see it. Yep. How do I get up there other than that cliff? Well, uh, back to the cliff I go. Oh, I would spawn my vehicle inside of a hedge maze. It's blocked behind whatever that is, so I don't know if... The... Can I drive today? I don't know if that's the mythic crate. I'm gonna just hope it is. Maybe start praying a little, but. I mean, it'd be nice if I could just figure out where it is already. Such a strange, like, look. It is the mythic crate. Yeah, whatever. I just need to get high enough up because I will lose my mind if I jump and miss it. Why does that look like I could almost use that? Down. Grab what was on the Starwalker. And grab this mythic crate. Agent set. You know what? While I'm here, there's the ability of a motel nearby. That means there's most likely going to be stuff in there that can have formulas. Might as well run in there and see if there's any good. Fill up what little bit of inventory space I got left. Nope. Nope, there's a creature in there that really wants to throw something at me, I guess. Ew, what is that? Oh, it's a spider egg. That's yeah, disgusting. Okay, he wasn't in here, right? Like, he just kind of appeared. There's no way that I missed that. Okay, not a lootable item. Not a, that's stupid. If this is, if this entire hotel has these unlootable freaking side tables. Not looking good. I feel like the, I'm getting the loot out of suitcases instead of the side tables. And from my history, there is uh, nothing of value coming out of those suitcases. 
I've never gotten anything of value out of it. Okay, well, time to go back to my house. I'm gonna clear my inventory and then uh, probably call the stream there. Get him away, Glosh room. Glosh? It's Glosh room. Uh. I feel like there's just, like supposed to be something there. Pretty sure nobody's gonna want to see me do this, but hey, y'all are gonna if anybody's actually watching. end it here um to anybody that actually did watch this live stream thank you and uh we're probably gonna end up streaming again soon so uh yeah